me. I wanted to talk about um, body language. Um, well, I know that when I was going through my psychosis and I didn't know, one of the main things I thought the people all around me were in on it was because of um, nonverbal cues like clearing their throat or um, <clears> while <throat> scratching their nose or clearing their throat, like to insinuate something that I needed to pay attention to for some reason. And then I noticed when I had that split and I could hear the voice in my head clearly, the other part in there, that entity, that when I had the synthetic telepathy from the attack from AI on 5G and my phone, um, I noticed that when it was trying to integrate and it was, it could have been my higher self coming through and talking to me. You know, one tap yes, two tap no, or I start to think about what about when I clear my own throat, or like if, I, if you catch yourself clearing your throat, going <clears throat> if you catch yourself doing that and you don't really have anything in your throat and you're not coughing or you know you're not drunk something or something like that that's made made you clear your throat because you're choking or something. I noticed I started pay attention to to what I'm doing if I catch myself clearing my throat because it's a sign of change of energy. So, <clears throat> there, I just did it just then. And there wasn't anything in my throat. So, I need to pay attention to what I'm doing. Maybe, if you try to, if it happens to you, try to catch yourself clearing your own throat. And when, you're, when you do, if you're clearing your throat for no reason, pay attention to what you're doing at that moment in time. Because I feel like that's what it, it, it is when I internalize it. When I clear my throat and there's no physical reason for me to be clearing my throat it's like my higher self telling me pay attention to either what you just said what you're doing and then why are you paying attention to it that seems to help for some reason and it because it, it always reminds me of my mom too because when I catch myself clearing my throat in my head it sounds like my mom clearing her throat and so I always pay attention to be like Heidi what are you doing right now are you doing something you shouldn't be doing <laughs> something like that it kind of helps to know that it it was just people and but watching other people like I watch Ronnie all the time my boyfriend when he's talking with he he clears his throat a lot and he doesn't realize he does it and I'll pay attention to what this is you know we're talking about and when he clears his throat when he's saying something usually it's either getting ready to be a lie or he's getting ready to tell me something that might piss me off usually not always but usually that's what that means when he clears his throat, and if you watch other people when they clear their throat, so they don't realize they're doing it subconsciously. Pay attention to what they're doing and what they're saying when they do it, and don't take it as in that they're in on something behind your back and they're coughing to signal something that you need to respond to, or that somebody else in the room is responding to, like behind your back. Don't look at it like that. If you get bothered by nonverbal gestures like that, and you're schizophrenic, or as I like to call a psychic, because for diagnosed schizophrenic, you might as well just say that you're psychic. Yeah. You're psychic. Which is not a bad thing. You're smart. But pay attention to other people. People's nonverbals. And don't internalize others' external nonverbal cues because they don't realize they're doing it. It's subconscious too for them. Don't internalize that. Is that it has something to do with some kind of something they're in on that you don't know about take it as it's, they're expressing something that they, they're they uncomfortable probably probably if, they're caught, if they clear their throat they're uncomfortable communicating probably it, you know it's a nervous habit for a lot of people but if you pay attention to it when you do it and catch yourself doing it it helps a lot it just does to, to, to have a step back and look at what it is that you're doing where you're at that time what you just said what you're doing why you why did you clear your throat? Think about that if you get yourself doing it for no reason, if you're not choking. So, I don't know why I wanted to talk about that, but I just did. Love you, see you, bye.